Hello, Ray. Welcome in, my love. How are you? You did make it. You're here. Right on time, too. Hello, Sky. How are you? Good to see you again. I'm so glad you both stopped in. How's your day going so far? I'm well. I was glad to hear you got everything up and running. Yes, we did. So feel free to try um, the daily latte uh, channel point reward if you would like to. It should be working. Hear me very well, Ray. Sorry about this, you guys. <laughs> Still getting used to like having multiple monitors and whatnot. Sky, yep. Just gotta, there you go, perfect. Oh, Score Bunny! That is the best! What a good starter Pokemon. Ray, I'm not sure what yours is. I'm sure you know what that one is. Yeah, <laughs> that's funny. Alright, we'll get started with Pylea in just a second. I do just want to check something. Um, I want to see if I can get this channel point thing to work. So I was really excited about it. Okay, mine's working now. I almost wonder if I need to have this mix it up open. Um, so what I'm gonna do, okay, gotcha. What I'm gonna do just for a minute is I'm going to change, um, change something real quick on my Twitch account um, to see if you guys can try the Daily Latte one more time. If it doesn't work, I'll, I'll do the rest of the troubleshooting off stream, but I just want to try this one thing because I'm 99% sure this is the problem. Okay, yeah, fingers crossed. Thank you so much for your patience. Okay, if you're willing, no pressure either way, but go ahead and redeem that daily latte one more time. Um, so let, let me see if it works. Yes, okay, we fixed it. All right. So yeah, I just have to have the app open and it works. I'm so excited, how much fun is that? Yeah, let's go. Ray got a matcha latte, Sky got chai. Love it, love it, my two favorites. All right, looks like we can, can do the paleo stuff now. I'm so excited, I haven't actually played since the update dropped. Well, I did hop on to like claim my uh, reward drops, but 
I haven't like actually played any content yet, so I'm so excited. Okay. Uh, let's see. I think I'm gonna go to Zeki's real quick and try to get these coins. Um, used up. Yeah, Sky, do you play Paleo? I think you mentioned you were playing it or you were starting to play it. But yeah, if you guys connect your... Oh, this is such a cute message. I like the Singularity 6 dev so much. They're honestly so sweet. So yeah, if you um, connect your Twitch account to your Paleo account, um, or wait, hold on a second. Yep, okay. Good, I'm glad to hear that. I haven't tried yet. My day's going well. I'm actually almost finished editing a YouTube video. So I'll be lurking until I get that done. Perfect. Sounds good. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited to play together. I hope your video turns out how you're hoping. Um, but make sure you have your drops enabled um, so that you can get your rewards. And if you're unsure how to do that, um, the link will let you know the link that's in the chat. Just click that, um, the Paleo Steve drops, and it'll walk you through step by step how to connect them. Let me know if you need help. The, um, items just for having the stream, uh, watching the stream. Easy, easy. I love these. Oh my goodness. These are hydrangea bushes, yeah? How do I get these? Okay, I have so much to find out. I'm so excited. I haven't um, watched a ton of it either. I, I ended up uh, hanging out in Jupiverse's stream yesterday for a bit, and then I watched Nimbly play today. Um, but we were mostly chatting, so I, I don't actually know how to get these bushes, and I'm really looking forward to figuring that out, because I cannot wait to decorate with them. Your eyes remind me of a gillyfin's. Salutations, companion. I require assistance of a humanoid nature. I was aspiring for yours in particular. Oh. Hmm. Aw, the sky orb. That's sweet. Since you are an expert at accessing spaces you should not, I thought you might be interested in the challenge. I love the story in this game. They did such a good job. Oh, I just realized um, the camera is over some of the dialogue. If that bothers anyone, let me know, and I will move that slideshow.
We may now meditate in silence together. Okay, I'm gonna talk to all the villagers. I've not been on in so long, so I really wanna catch up with everybody. Ani said something about um, putting bugs in the fireplace or something. Um, and so I'm kinda wondering, what happened there? Um, They're disappearing. Huh. I don't know if, if these always looked this way or if it's just different because I'm on the computer now, but like, why are the stones just disappearing? Huh? Or the nodes? That's very strange. grass looks much um, fuller as well. I did a really good job. I'm just gonna walk around and explore a little bit and see what I can find that might be different. wondering if if it looks better because I'm on the PC or if it's because of the update um, but yeah it looks so good or gold star bug. and see um, what's going on in here. I need to collect some iron anyway, and I need some helium, of course. flowers too oh my goodness <laughs> the 
game sound is a bit loud at some point. I may want to go into the game settings and drop it a couple notches. Gotcha. Sound effects, volume, or overall? Probably sound effects, right? Overall? Okay. Let's try this and... I still have to get used to this game again. It's been so long since I played. Love the outfit, by the way. My paleo outfit or my snuggie.
forgot to put, change my worm. Um, so what is on the agenda today in Palea? Questing. Um, questing. Maybe. I honestly didn't make an agenda because I haven't been on in so long. I just want to kind of like wander around aimlessly <laughs> um, and just like see how pretty everything is um but i just want to kind of check and see if i can naturally find out like what's different um which is why i haven't watched like too many spoilers or anything like that yet um because i just want to kind of like go adventure and find stuff so yeah we're not really structuring this like i do like animal crossing i just want to like run around and see things <laughs> And if we come up with something that we want to do, then we'll do it. Like right now, I'm like, uh-uh, I feel like fishing. Um, so that's what I'm going to do for a second. And I haven't played in so long, to be honest. I just kind of want to spend a little bit of time and get used to the controls and stuff again um and also this is my first time you know i know i've said this already but this is my first time playing on my pc so um it feels a lot different in a good way um but it does take some getting used to Like, I can't even get over how gorgeous these colors are. Like, I'm really wondering if they really um, improved the graphics since I last played, or if it's just this computer is so much better. It's so vibrant. Gorgeous. I love these so much. Look how pretty. Like, even this, the wood coloring on this is so beautiful. I love this so much. Wow. This game is so well done. This too. I don't know, there's something about these colors together that I just love. Like, they did such a great job with the natural setting. Okay, but I actually do need to get iron. <laughs> I keep getting distracted, but I probably should try to mine to get some iron. And, uh, helium. So yeah, maybe I'll go do that. Oh, these are so pretty. Look at the leaves. Like, are you kidding me? love this, like peach, pink, and like, I don't know, teal-ish, it's so pretty. I want to encourage everybody else to hydrate too. I know, I'm so excited for you to get home so you can play with me. Oh, I need to go. Let's go this way. 
navigation is not my strong suit, y'all. But I am practicing and I have confidence that I'll get better. I'm hoping I'm going the right way. How do I use my bow? <laughs> Does anybody know? How do I use my bow? Oh my goodness. I can't remember things. Way too late now, though. Like, honestly, <laughs> still a couple I think I changed my sprint button to either Q or tab. I don't know. I need the Paleum more. <laughs> Let's wait until this gets broke. Yeah, right. Thank you so much for um, teaching me how to change the key bindings because it's honestly once you know how to get to that menu, it's it's a lot easier to figure out the controls when you forget them. <laughs> appreciate that. Helped a lot. I'm just kind of searching around here to see if I can find I can help. Still more IT work for me to do, but we are getting there. <laughs> True. <laughs> yeah, I mean, all that's really left is cable management, right? Like, we're doing a really good job. Make a good team. Oh, 
Oh, the audio. I feel like everybody is always like so concerned about audio. It's like one of those things that I feel like people are constantly trying to improve and tweak. I feel like it's one of those things that just like always be a little bit better, you know? Sorry, Malkai. I did not know you were you were hitting as well. I apologize. So yeah, one thing I have noticed, and it's probably an easy fix, but um, every time I want to go over to my other monitor to um, type, in, type in the chat or do anything with OBS, I do have to like pause my game like this. Otherwise, my mouse like won't go over to the other monitor. But so far, that's the only thing I've noticed um, that seems to be like annoying uh, or whatever um, during the stream today. It looks like I have mail, uh, so I'm gonna probably go home soon and check that. Maybe I will do some questing, because um, I can still wander around as much as I want, but, but maybe I'll get some stuff done that way. Maybe they'll kind of lead me to some of the newer things.
know there was like some sort of secret entrance to uh, like some chests and stuff over here, but I thought it was down farther. Like down there. So I'm curious what this is for. Explore it some more later. The vampire crab's just floating. Oh, there he goes. Comes on, crab. one of these forageables or like maybe a huntable. It's a, a sound I'm not familiar with hearing before in this game.
keep a lady waiting. You're growing on me, little lamb. I'm so glad. Are they working for you, or is it too soon to tell? You should get a drop within 30 minutes. You should get some smoke bombs. 50 of them, I think. Yeah, you have to go in. Um, so the way... That, oh, wow, this is gorgeous. Oh, my, and there's another player in here? Cool. Before, like, a lot of the temples, we could go in together. This is beautiful. I love how they did the yellow and the purple together with this greenery. Wow, it's so pretty. Okay, so I don't know if I want to do the temple without you, though, Ray. I'm going to wait. Do this when you get home. We can stream some more tomorrow or something. I'm wondering if it's multiple players. Yeah, I saw someone in here for a second. Um, so the way that you claim the drops is uh, go into your map and there's this little button called news right here at the top right. Um, so once you go there, it'll they'll show up here and then you can just like, there's a button around this area, it'll say claim or something like that. Um, so yeah, you'll get the 50 smoke bombs, uh, the pal cat, um, plushy, the sand, sandy one, and then this vent. That's what the drops are for this week. Yeah, I'm gonna do this temple um, when we have more, when I have more company. Um, I think that'd be really fun to do together. I like to do them. Usually with uh, with my husband or with one of my friends here that plays. Uh, but if anyone's in chat right now and you want to work on the temple together, let me know. <laughs> wow, it's beautiful. The water is so shimmery. Oh, a flow tree. Baby one. Yeah, it's kind of medium. Actually, wait, that's larger than I thought. Let's pick her one of these.
interesting. Go back to Kalima soon and explore around there a bit. I really want to. I never noticed that Tamala's uh, chimney gives off like an actual like potion smoke. Look at that, it's green. That is such a cute touch. I love that so much. Do you have a favorite part about this game? I think mine are the outfits, even though you buy them. They do have really good outfits. Um. But to be honest, my favorite part of this game is just wandering around and like foraging. Um, especially if I'm by myself. If I'm with other people, I really like bug catching. I think bug catching is the most fun thing to do with other people. Um, but I love just wandering around, foraging and like seeing the scenery. I could do this all day and not accomplish anything, just like pick stuff up. I, I honestly, could do that and I would be happy. <laughs> hey, listen. I don't think your old computer generated the smoke. <gasps> Hi, Elena. Welcome in. How are you today? Good to see you. We're doing paleo today instead of Animal Crossing. <laughs> How's your day going?
Also, Elena, um, really quick, let me kind of put the drops command in for you. Um, if you don't know how to turn the drops on, uh, click this link and see if you can, can do that so that you can get your rewards um, if you haven't already done so and if you would like to do that. That way, um, it'll add up too. So if you switch over to another Paleo streamer, um, it'll still you'll still get credit for being here. Um, and you know the time is the time watch is cumulative, so you'll be you know at least get it going if you haven't already done so. so we need to watch for two and a half hours to get everything um, for this week. I'm doing good. I'm so glad my work today is almost over. Oh, I'm so glad for you too. It's Friday. Do you work on the weekends? Or do you have the next couple days off? I had a meeting with my CEO this morning at went well, but, but I felt anxious all week about it. Understandable. I was like, wow, why am I overthinking? <laughs> that is how it goes though. I feel like um, anticipation anxiety is a very real thing. Like I, uh, my husband and I both uh, talk about that a lot where it's like we're anxious about a thing that we know is probably going to be fine but we're anxious until it's over or until it starts and then once it starts like we feel more settled but yeah it's it's kind of silly that's actually one of my uh, my main like self-care goals right now is I'm trying to to learn how to soothe myself more um, when it comes to feeling anxious about things that I'm actually like that I know are pretty much going to be fine right like I tend to get a lot of anxiety um, that doesn't make any logical sense so um, I'm working with my nervous system a bit more to like help myself soothe and regulate that because um, like cognitively logically um, like that's not where the problem is <laughs> so I think that's you know I'm not sure how you're handling it. Um, everyone's different, but um, even if it's different for you, I'm really glad to know that I'm not the only one who feels that way sometimes. And I hope it helps you to know that you're not the only one either. and some oysters. I'm probably going to head back to the pot soon at home so that I can read my mail and see if maybe I can start some questing. I'm really curious about how to get the, the spring up. I want those hydrangea bushes so bad. I want to get them. So I think I'm going to try to figure that out today. Um, otherwise, I think I'm gonna wait on the temple, but I definitely, I wanna see if I can get those flowers. said she was starting I think like last week or a couple weeks ago one of those games that you either love it or it grows on you quickly or you just don't like it but I don't think there are many people that are in between on oh my inventory is full okay well we were gonna head home anyway let's just see if I can get a couple more notes and I work Monday through Friday, sometimes weekends if there's a concert. I'm in marketing for concerts and symphonies. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. I heard that that work can be quite busy. 
a lot of behind the scenes stuff going on. It can make for some long event days. I hope it's rewarding though. Do you enjoy what you do for the most part? Where's the grove? What am I missing? I'm just gonna go home. Because my pockets are so full. I do enjoy it. It's mostly computer work. I only go in person to get content for Instagram stories, which is fun. Oh. You know what? That makes a lot of sense. Honestly, Elena, because your social media looks so good. I'm like, okay, like she's got some transferable skills. <laughs> yeah. That makes sense. I could definitely see it. Potatoes and tomatoes, maybe. Ooh, that's a good Pokemon. How do I get Pokeballs? Oh, my goodness. Hold on a second. I'm running out of Pokeballs or something. I'll look into that later. I want to play Paleo right now, but yeah, if anybody could help me with that, like you already know, it'd be great. If not, I'll look at it later. 
I have no idea like what's going on with any of these scenes. It's been so long. Okay, so I think I typically put I'm gonna save my, my gold star apples and blueberries for our cake party that we're doing this. I usually just cook with the regular tomatoes though. And uh, I just plant like gold stars because you actually sell the seeds for quite a bit of money. Same thing with these um, peppers. The spicy pepper seeds are actually worth quite a bit compared to just the regular pepper, the gold star pepper. You caught Arcanine. Okay. Yeah, if we, thank you for the hydrate. If we um, don't have enough cake party stuff, I have extra things. Um, so we'll figure it out. I'm gonna check it tomorrow, make sure everyone has what they need. And if not, I'll make sure I pull stuff. And I might just pull backups just in case, because we're going to have a lot of newer players. Um, and I don't want anyone feeling, like, more anxious than necessary about it. You know, I want people to have fun. So I'll prepare. That way, um, you know, it won't be too bad if something goes wrong. Just a game. people will still get their rewards, you know? So yeah, I think I wanted to... I feel like alternate these. I don't know what, what this part layout is, but it usually... speed I have them alternating and then um can fit four apples and two blueberries two blueberries and two peppers or four blueberries so I like this layout a lot um, and then I usually alternate um, different crops I might need on the edges or I'll just alternate like tomatoes and potatoes because it keeps things watered and um easy layout to remember. It will be my first time, so I definitely need to get materials tonight, and I'm trying to get my friend to join the Discord so she can try me because it's her first time too. Yay, I'm so excited! Welcome in, Ashley. Hope you're doing well today. Good to see you. Yeah, so I'll help you guys out. Um, I figured what we could do um, is maybe do um, like a Discord chat, like a voice chat, like during the game. Um, so that, you know, if anybody has any questions or, you know, it's just like easier for people to communicate that way um, versus like texting and stuff when they're in the middle of trying to play. So that's an option if anybody wants to join. We can do the Discord like voice chat. Ashley, do you play Palea?
Oops, that's not what I meant to do. That's okay. Sorry, I'm still getting used to these controls. Oh my goodness, it's been so long since I played. Looks like I need a potato over here, right? Nope, it's already planted. Okay. Um, it looks like the garden is pretty full. I'm gonna get some fertilizer and then water it, and then we can go do some questing. You haven't played any games for a while now, you've been busy. Oh, that makes sense. both of these on, on my apples. Oh, Ashley, um, I did want to ask you, no pressure, um, and, and if you want to, like, um, speak in private about this, totally understandable, so we can you know, be professional about it, um, but I was curious if you knew how to make, uh, like, emotes for, like, the channel icons, uh, the channel point icons. Uh, if that's something you might be interested in, please let me know so we can talk about it, um, Message me on Discord or whatever's easiest for you. Um, email, whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm looking to get, uh, like, if you go to the channel point rewards, uh, right now I have, like, these little, like, moon coins, I guess, and uh, for channel points. Um, and I wanted to, like, get a couple different ones for, you know, the hydrate and stuff like that, see if we could do some fun little um, images that would match the, match some of the uh, channel point reward things, just to make it a little more fun. Or if anybody knows anyone who makes those, please let me know. Something I want to add soon. We did our garden right in time, didn't we? Oh my goodness, it's, it's morning now. It's morning. So it's gonna be a minute till we can quest because now I have more stuff to plant. So hold on one second. I know, me too. I really want to learn how to do um, 
some emotes and stuff, but I have so many other projects at the moment that I I just don't have time for that right now. But yeah, it's such a good skill to have. Canva is my best friend forever. <laughs> Same. Actually, I'm going to save these just in case. Um, we need a blue cup party because I know I have some. Apples, but I'd like to have some backup. Blueberries just in case.
it's almost ready to harvest. Oh, this one's with you, okay? That's why it doesn't need to watering. Anybody wants their daily latte, feel free to redeem that channel point. It's only one point. And it's just like a fun little stream check-in to say hello and let you know let everyone know you're here if you'd like to. Um, and you can collect um, up to 99, I think, right now. So you can get one per stream and then uh, just kind of collect them over time. It's just fun. chai latte today do you like chai lattes it's a random flavor but i'm just curious like what your favorite cozy drinks are um also if anybody has a favorite cozy drink or a favorite latte or tea or anything that you like let me know if you want me to add it to the list um chai tastes like christmas tea oh i love that yes um, I actually had a banana chai the other day, which I did not know about. Um, I had a pumpkin chai uh, a couple years ago, and I loved it. And I was like, okay, this is my new favorite drink. Um, but I had something called a banana chai, and it was honestly so, so good. Like, even better than the pumpkin. Like, it, it's my new favorite thing. It's so good. I never would have expected banana and chai to taste like heaven, but it does. It's amazing. So, yeah, anyway, uh, I don't know if I finished that thought. Sorry. Um, if anybody wants to let me know, like, a favorite drink that you have, um, I can add it to our list for the daily lattes, and um, it'll be in rotation for, like, the random you know, be randomized, so maybe you'll get it every now and again. on here okay catch blue butterflies until you get a gardenia <gasps> goodness yes we're doing that we're definitely doing that hold on wait Unpin. i want the flowers okay what else do we have Let's have a picnic with Gina. We, I think we can do that whenever. Okay. 
emotional oh. damage. Why was why? <laughs> yeah, what just happened? <laughs> Were you just testing it out? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I like that one. Oh my goodness. Okay, so like if anybody wants to get on Helia and catch bugs with me, I won't be mad. Because we can get flowers. I have to buy something from Zeki so that I get my uh, gold coin. Let's do a milk. Hello, Stephanie. Good to see you. How are you today, friend? No worries about missing the beginning of stream. We're all on our own time hey, frames here. It's listen. all good. Hope you're well. We're playing Palea, as you can see. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing. I haven't been on this game in so long, so part of it is just me trying to get used to it again. Um, and also, I'm on a quest to like find these flowers. I need to go catch blue butterflies. My parents like when I you think in order by. to get some new flowers. I am well, just working. Yay, yay, it's Friday. You're all good, Ray. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I, I think I knew what you, I knew what you were referring to. Let me know Stephanie was here. I appreciate you. Oh. Hmm. Oh. Maybe next time I'll come see you. Okay, so I actually think I might um, try to get some buggies. So I imagine um, I'll probably get a gardenia at some point when I loot the bugs. But I have no idea. I could be completely wrong. <laughs> um, but Ani said to just catch the blue butterflies until we can find the gardenia. So I'm hoping I'll get like a seed or something. And if not, it's fine because I still just love walking around this world because it's literally so beautiful. <laughs> okay, Chapa. Yeah, Stephanie, um, I started a new thing and I'm hoping that um, it's, it's something that you guys enjoy. Um, it's called Daily Latte. So it's just a fun little stream check-in, it's optional. Um, but if you would like, feel free to redeem the channel point for Daily Latte and you'll get, um, you'll get one. You get one per stream and you just collect them over time. It's just like a fun little thing. Ah, there you go. Thank you, thank you. What'd you get? A pumpkin spice? That's fitting. That's fitting for you. They're random. The flavors are random. Um, and if anyone has Here's any suggestions on like a latte flavor ahead. or a cozy drink that they like, yeah, perfect for me. I agree, it's perfect for you. <laughs> I love that. Um, I'm open to suggestions too. If you have any other favorite cozy drinks that you want me to add to the rotation, I'm happy to do that. Just let me know in the chat or in the Discord and I'll add them ASAP. Badger just called me Spuddy, and I love it. That is so cute. Hmm. 
I'll see you around, unless I see you a square. <laughs> All right. Oh, that drew. I love this area. Oh, I love this orchard. I honestly, I know it's not the most efficient way to do the farm, but I legitimately might just put my plots like in separate spots so that peppermint latte. Gotcha. Yeah, we can do some Christmas drinks, winter drinks. I love it. That pun was the perfect thing to tune back into. I know, Badger's got the best dialogue. Oh my goodness. But I was thinking about um, taking my garden plots or soil plots or whatever they're called and like moving them um, around and making like a little orchard. Uh, but I'm not sure yet. I might, maybe I'll wait and do it in the fall. Maybe I'll just play around with it, see. But I think that would be so fun. So Sky, I actually have no idea what I'm doing um, in Palea. I'm just kind of like wandering around and because I haven't played the update at all. Uh, so I'm I'm sort of like trying to catch these, catch these butterflies because I think I might get a flower this way. Um, but I have no idea if it's going to work. So just letting everyone know so I don't waste your time. I am literally just like messing around today. I like to learn as I go. I don't like to look up a lot of spoilers and stuff. to jump on here and like catch bugs with me that'd <laughs> be fun Ray are you having uh, is it hard to hear me is the sound okay I know I'm sort of a quiet speaker Okay, all right, at least for now. Yeah, if I get too quiet and I put, let me know, I sometimes will mumble and I'm just kind of a quiet speaker in general. Um, so I'll try to be mindful, but I know sometimes it'll happen. It might be a little hard to hear me, just let me know. I could also turn on closed captions if anybody's interested in that. Mostly when you talk, <clears throat> when you're like hunched over looking at chat. That makes sense because I'm probably like reading it to myself, but still saying it out loud. <laughs> wow. Gotcha. I'll try to be more mindful though. Thank you for letting me know. Oh, Sky. Good job. Great catch. Yeah, I do too. I don't know how to do it. Um, how to replenish the Pokeballs for Poke the Pokemon community game. Yeah, I keep keep getting that message. I'll look into that later. There's a shop in the panel. Gotcha. Okay. Um, Ray, do you know how to do that? It's down below in the about section. Maybe try 
there. What was that? Oh, that's a big bumper. I'm so excited! Well, we figured something out today. Stream's over. We're done. We got the flower. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Just kidding, y'all. We gotta plant it. Wasting a magistrate's time is a serious offense. <gasps> oh, was that your first Pokemon game? That's so cute. So exciting. Yeah, I'm curious if what um what are some of the first games you guys remember playing as a kid? Like, what were your favorite, um, your favorite nostalgic games from as early as you can remember? We must do this again. <laughs> Stream better not be over. I need some cozy in my life. I got you, Ray. I'll stay until you're done with work, at least. And Stephanie, too. I know it helps you. This is so pretty. Stephanie, are you gonna play Palea? It's free. If you haven't already started playing, it's it's so fun. Your streams definitely keep me calm while I'm working and today involves code, so I need it. <laughs> that makes sense. Ooh, Monster Hunter stories. Scribble knots, Animal Crossing New Leaf, Pokemon Sun. Love it, love it, love it. Scribble knots, that sounds fun. I've never seen that. Um, there's a new, or it's not new, it's new to me though. Uh, it's called Laddle Knot. It might be a newer game, but I saw that and that's one that I was thinking about trying. Um, which you might be surprised because it's like underwater stuff, but I might actually give it a go. I'm actually interested in Subnautica, believe it or not. I just, um, it's one of those things that I'm like, do I have time to start a new game? But I do, I mean, it is kind of like on my, my list, so my bucket list, I suppose. Okay, how do I plant these? Like, I'm curious if I have to do them in my garden or... Wait. I think I can just plant them. So I wonder, okay, do I want to put them here or do I want to put them in my museum? Uh, I think I'm going to put some here and in my museum, but let's try. Okay, so it needs at least that many squares. Okay. 
Let's hope it'll grow if I place it this close. Water the trees now? What's happening? I don't remember that happening. Is that why they're like brown? Like there's dirt around them now? Is everything connected? Interesting. I will say I love that. I love the um, animation. I have no idea what this does, but clearly it does something now, so I'm just gonna like water trees for a second. Underwater stuff panics in Subnautica. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I have that thing, uh, submechanophobia, where you're afraid of like man made things underwater. It's not a real phobia, it's not like a diagnostic uh, thing. Um, but it's it's enough of a common experience to where, you know, there's a word for it. Um, and it's definitely something I've experienced since I was a child. No idea why. You know, I love being in the water. I love doing water things. But, you know, when it comes to, like, seeing a, a buoy or, like, the underside of, like, a dock or something, I'm like, no. Nope. There, there's there's definitely monsters in there or something. Like something is gonna come bite me or suck me under the water. <laughs> or there's gonna be some kind of like whirlpool vortex that doesn't make any scientific sense, but it's gonna happen to me. <laughs> kind of funny when I think about it, but it does give me like this really icky feeling. Um, so I try to stay away from those things. I, it started off when I was younger as like a pool filter here, I guess. Like I didn't want to go by the filters because I thought they'd like suck me in. Um, and then it just kind of started growing from there. I'm like generalizing to other stuff in the water. And it's interesting though, because I'm actually like fascinated by shipwrecks, even though that's part of the part of the reason I think I, I found out that I sort of experienced this thing is because I was on the boat one time um, with my family. And we used to do this thing where we'd like tie the raft, like an inner tube or something, like an inflatable, like different inflatable toys and stuff. We would tie them onto the back of our boat and like just kind of like go for rides and stuff. And I fell off because, like, it's fun. We, we would sometimes just, like, go fast and people would fall off. We wore life jackets and everything, you know, it's just fun. And um, so I'm, I'm, like, floating there, like, waiting for my dad or whoever. Uh, my dad, really, at that, at that point. Um, my dad was driving the boat. I was like, okay, like, I have to wait for him to come get me. So I'm just floating there, waiting for the boat to turn around. And I see this, like, bottle. It's, like, this bright orange bottle of Tide laundry detergent um, just like floating and so I kind of like look over and I'm like okay what is that and so this bottle this like empty bottle of like lot from uh, empty laundry detergent bottle was like on a string and it was tied to some sort of like crow's nest and I was like there is a pirate ship or like a sunken freighter or something right underneath me and it was the worst feeling <laughs> ever like Oh my gosh, I panicked and like, it was fine. Nothing happened, obviously. Um, like it was just, you know, some rubble uh, in the lake. But, um, oh my goodness, it was, it felt like forever for my dad to turn around and come get me because I was just like, this is, the, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'll never forget. <laughs> I 
I'm terrified of the ocean in general. I mean, there's a lot of unknowns. I think it's a pretty common fear, like ocean, outer space. You know, I'm, I'm both fascinated and terrified by them. I should probably go refill my water bottle or water watering can. So I imagine I can probably like water this like once a day and I really wonder how long it'll take to grow because I'm so excited. I just want one. I think I'm gonna go try to find some more flowers. We have 60 smoke bombs on us. I think I'm gonna get some more. Let's see. What would they be under? Tools, probably? Yeah, okay. Okay, 100 should be plenty. Probably way more than enough, honestly. Actually, let me see if there are any other quests I definitely want to pin for today. Um, I think some of these will probably just trigger by walking around and talking to the villagers too, so focus on the flowers for now. I think my favorite game from when I was like really little was Donkey Kong. But that's only because I didn't get Spyro the Dragon until like third or fourth grade. I also really enjoyed playing playing the Sonic games too. But I didn't have a Sega. Um, my stepsister did, so I would always play when I went to her house. Oh, these flowers are so Hello, pretty. Human. I can't wait until I can grow some. My Gina needs me. Oh, you are not going to believe my latest theory. you how to think. Did he? I 
interesting. Okay, Gina. Thank you for sharing the Discord link, Ray. Yes, if anybody wants to sign up for the cake party tomorrow, um, please check it out uh, under the Discord um, server channel, um, Cake Parties. We still need quite a bit of people, so... If you're interested, please, please sign up. I'd love to meet you if I haven't already. You're more than welcome. Um, and we're, we do have quite a few new people doing the cake party, so um, that is something to keep in mind. Um, if you're new, it's a really good, good um, starting place. Um, but if you're um, interested in a cake party that's like gonna 100% run really smoothly, you know, we're doing our best, but we have to be patient and kind to the newer people too. So um, just keep that in mind as well if you sign up. Um, there are many other groups out there too that have like more experienced players if you're looking for that instead. Um, but this one is definitely gonna be more of a like beginner friendly cake party. I wanna make sure everybody, um, you know, has a fun time um, and can learn as, as easily as possible. So I wanna make sure the environment is supportive of that first and foremost. Gina giving the new temple quest? <laughs> Maybe. Oh. Hedla keeps staring at us. The books here have stood the test of time. Interesting. I wonder if she's talking about that place that I was trying to figure out where it went earlier. Oh. A curious mind can be wonderful <laughs> or terrible. Excuse me. I am so glad to see you. so terrified all oh, it's sad nobody should feel that way in their marriage no one ever lets me talk this long here to cause some trouble I love Sifu, she's so fun. Ooh. Huh? I might have someone. Nope. What's this? Ah, do I really not have what she needs? That's fine. I think I need... What are they made out of? I'll, I'll go make some. I thought it was the... The gray one. Oh. Interesting. 
interesting. Oh, that's terrifying. No, we're not going there, Sifu. That's so sweet. I love that. That reminds Any me of our cousin Katie. Just call Sifu. Now you give me a holler if you ever need milk or a couple of eggs. Nice someone came to see me for a change. How's the day treating you? Save you a seat by the hearth. Wait to do the bundle for the next temple. I know I'm so excited. Gold star bugs, hopefully. <laughs> I'm really, um, that'd be great, but I'm really just wanting to do, I want more flowers to plant. I want more um, flower bushes. butterflies or if you'll get um eventually will we get more flowers catching other bugs too curious about that <gasps> yes okay Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna catch all the bugs. That's what we're doing today. We're getting all the flowers. We're catching all the bugs. Oh my goodness. I cannot wait to decorate with these things. I have to take a break from work. My eyes are crossing and nothing is working. Oh, Stephanie. It's understandable. It happens sometimes. Yeah, taking a break sometimes leads to breakthroughs. Yeah, sometimes, honestly, um, if you're feeling like you need a break and you keep pushing yourself, sometimes it just makes it worse. 
But if you give yourself a little bit of a breather, you might come back feeling a little bit better. I mean, I know you know that, but sometimes it's just good to remind ourselves. No, I'm not decorating with the bugs instead of eating them. <laughs> I, I want to get the flowers. You get flowers from catching bugs now, apparently. Oh, sorry, you guys. I just moved the mouse very rapidly. I apologize. Still getting used to it. This is my first time streaming a PC game ever, so... It's kind of hoping... Hoping I'll get better. wants to jump on Palea um, and, and catch bugs with me, let me know. I might have a honey lure. I'm not going to call anything out about my honey lure or catching bugs until I go actually get the honey lure, though, because I don't want people to have to wait or risk um, the server getting mixed up. Oh, this is one of those... I think this is a firefly sakina, or not a firefly sakina. Um, the dragonfly. Fire-breathing dragonfly. Not a gold star, though, I don't think. No, nope, not a gold star. But still very pretty. I love those. Need to get some pork balls. Okay, everyone, just give me a second. I really want to get some Pokeballs so I can continue playing Pokemon Community Game with you. So, let me see here real quick if I can do that. Let me see here. Sorry. Also, hold on, let me enter something in chat. It looks like I can... Okay, so we need at least five active Pokemon community game players in the chat before I can gift you guys this present. Okay, I'll try again later. Hopefully when we have more people, more of a, you know, larger community, people that play.
Okay, because the time just switched over. Uh, a gold star butterfly. Emerald carpet moss looked a bit different than usual. Again, don't know if they changed the design or if it's just because I'm on a better computer now. Uh, but that definitely looked different than what I'm used to seeing on my screen. I've thought of you. I, I mean, dressing you. Never mind. Just a friendly reminder to anyone um, who might be trying to get your drops, make sure they're enabled if you're getting your paleo drops. Um, if you need help with anything, let me know. I'll do my best to help you. Um, and if you need more information, just um, go ahead and type exclamation mark drops in the chat and you get a link to um, how to set them up and what they are if you don't know yet. Um, and then of course, after that, um, after you read those two articles, let me know if you have any questions, and I'll try to help you as best as I can. I want to make sure everybody gets their items. What bug do you get? Silk? Vivian? Um...
what other, um, so this, uh, Vivian's asking which bugs do you get silk from? Does anybody know any other bugs besides the centipedes? Like those, like, pink centipede things or millipedes? Um, I want to make sure I give her or them, um, the correct information. Okay, so jewel wing dragonfly. Some moths. Yeah, a, a lot of these are more rare. Yeah, I think you're right. I think there are some moths, too. Oh, it was a leaf. Okay. Fingers crossed, I believe this code to work, back to work I go. Fingers crossed, I believe in you. Eventually it's got to, right? You just, it's, it's more a matter of how many times we gotta try. And I know you have a lot of um, really good people in your industry too, so like if you need support, like remember, you can always ask. You know, the worst they can say is no, or they're not sure how to do it, but I feel like, um, you know, maybe that'll help too, if, if needed, just having like someone else that um, might have some more info. back towards this way. Oh, 
gonna need a snack break soon um which is it's good timing because our pockets just got full so yeah i think i'm gonna grab a snack and then uh, i'll come back and we can do some just chatting for a bit um and you know i'm, I'm gonna leave um paleo on uh so that everyone can still get their drops though um so i'll have to make this a, a very quick run so I do want to be, uh, like, honest about uh, the drops and stuff like that. Um, but at the same time, like, you know, got to get a snack. So I'm just going to run and grab one real quick, and then we'll keep um, playing Palea and just chat for a bit. Um, Up for some trouble? Dropping in for a chat or what? Hmm. Uh. Okay, now I'm stuck. I, I don't know how to answer this because I really am not that interested in Kenyatta. I'm not going to lie. Um, I wanted to, like, date everybody in the game so that I could, like, get the items. But now I'm, like, kind of, like, emotionally invested and I feel really bad. Aw, I was actually having fun. I'll answer that later. I need to go think about what I've done. Oh, wrong one. Ah, my inventory is full, but it won't be once you take my coin. That's not fair. I only have one coin on me. Glad I didn't scare you off last time. <laughs> huh? uh, let's chat more later, okay? Thank you. 
beautiful. I'm so excited to plant these. No way! Look how gorgeous! Oh my god! Oh, it's so cute! It's so pretty! Oh, I'm so excited! Oh my gosh, this game! Who thought? It got better! Like, how? This is so... Oh my god, they're so pretty! Oh! Look at them. Oh my gosh. I love this. I'm going to put one back here too. Oh my goodness. How beautiful. Sure, where I want. I am so excited. Oh my goodness, these are so pretty. Oh, I'm gonna put some like right under my window. I wonder if you can move them, though, like if they're easy to move because... I don't actually know what they're gonna look like when they grow. I love this. Oh. Welcome in, Rosie. Good to see you. Um, we, no advertising in our chat. Um, there's, um, there's a self promo uh, channel in the Discord if you're interested in that. Um, we, no advertising in, uh, on the Twitch channel. We might have younger people here. But welcome in. I'm glad to see you. Oh, there it goes. Okay, actually, 
Ray, are you here? Sorry about that, everyone. Thanks for waiting. I wanted to put put some drop information up for anyone coming in who might be new. Now, back to our bug hunting. Um, I'm going to go repair my tools. take a little bit of a break get, get a snack and then you know we can keep i'm um, looking for flowers because uh, i'm honestly loving it and i want to decorate with all of them all uh, right so i'm gonna put some music on for everybody and i will be right back
how is everybody feeling about the music? Do you want to keep the music on or would you prefer just to have the game sounds? You got it to work. I'm so happy for you, Stephanie. Good job. You got this. Did I repair my tools? I did before before I got my snack, right? Okay, let's see here. No preference on the music. The music is nice. Okay, let's leave it on for a bit. If anyone wants um, wants it off at some point, we can always change it at that at that time. I think I like it personally. Glad to see you've returned safely. Huh. Mm. Good to see a friend.
love watermelon. Who else here loves watermelon? Got some watermelon in the here. So good. Sorry, hold on. Sorry, I know you can probably hear some of the chewing. I agree. Definitely one of my favorite fruits. Actually, so slow down here for a second. everybody today let's just chat for a second check in with you let me know how you're doing stressful but I'm feeling more and more accomplished as I work on it. I'm so happy to hear that Stephanie. Sinus headache but you're all right. I'm sorry Ray. I hope you drink some water and I hope that um, your medicine helps. Okay, so it's 447.
You know what? Um, I know why I'm feeling off at the moment, but to be honest, I don't know how I want to address it on stream. So I'm not going to say anything at the moment, but um, I'm trying to figure out how I can continue streaming at the moment without like addressing the issue. So I just, uh, I'm not sure if we should wrap up stream or if I can figure out something else. So you know what? I'm just I'm just gonna say it because you know I think what's holding me back from saying it is that I'm I'm worried about how it's gonna be received. But here's the thing. The safety of my community is is the most important thing. Um, first and foremost. And If I ignore the issue, I feel like that's also problematic. So I'm just gonna say something about it. Um, there's a reason I have a no advertising rule. Um, and I, I wasn't sure how to address this because the last thing that I want to do is to make artists feel unwelcome or make it difficult for them to get business, right? Like, I want this to be a place where we can support each other. However, there has been, there have been a lot of scams going around um, in particular, uh, Twitch graphics, emotes, and um, quite recently I actually paid for some artwork, found that it was a scam, um, and there are a lot of red flags I'm seeing with some of the artists that are promoting their products in, in the chat, in Discord, and so what I'm going to say um, is that I want everyone to be very careful. Um, and if you're a legitimate artist, you have nothing to worry about. Um, but if you're not, and as soon as I find out that you are not, um, you will be booted from all of our communities. Um, and the reason for that um, is because I just don't, I don't want anyone in this community to be taken advantage of uh, financially or otherwise. Um, if there's anything that I can do to prevent it, I'm going to do that. So um, I think that's all I'm going to say about it. Um, and I guess people can take that as they will. Like I'm open to feedback, but um, I'll put it this way. I'm open to feedback, but I'm not going to um, be gaslit or anything into allowing certain activities to take place in this community. So we'll just leave it at that, okay? And with that said, I do appreciate all of the artists that are here. Um, I just hope that you are doing business in a way that is kind to other people and to yourself. <sighs> and I do, I feel a little bit better now. Um, that was difficult for me to do, but I feel it's important. 
really do. You know, I feel like, um... I don't know, I just, I... I trust people. Until they give me a reason to not trust them. Yeah, I mean... I, I checked that Instagram account and it's definitely, um... I'll just say this. The Instagram account that posted, um has the same artwork as the person that I paid um, that wasn't an artist. So I'm at this point, I'm, I'm kind of led to believe that either there's a big scam going around and or, uh, you know, people are just like advertising uh, someone else's artwork on their Instagram accounts because, you know, it's just, it's a red flag to me when I see, like, first of all, you don't have a shop page. And I get it, like, people are new artists, they sometimes don't. Um, but when I see all these, like, stock photos, um, it just, it, it makes me wonder, right? And I just, I don't want that in this community because I don't think that that is um, a, an honest way to do business. And I also don't know, you know, we might have, you know, Twitch has rules, you know, I have to be a certain age to be on Twitch, but, uh, I don't know, I just want to protect everyone that's here that may be vulnerable in any way. So, uh, I'm just going to let you guys know about what happened to me and, you know, make your own judgments. Um, because again, the last thing I'd want to do is to make this more difficult for like newer artists or younger artists or, you know, I don't want to make anything more difficult for that. But the reality of the situation is these scams, they, um, they'll take your money, they send you like some watermarked image as a sample and then sometimes they ask you for more money. Um, and then you just never get your product. So if that happens to you, please let me know because I, I don't want those kind of advertisements here. I don't want anyone to have to worry about that. So sorry that happened to you. I've had something similar happen to me too. Understandable. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Again, I, I'm not trying to accuse anyone, um, which I guess I am. I guess I am technically accusing people. Um, but I think it's it's simply because it, it, it's happened. Like, it's a real thing. I'm not just assuming that. Um, so just, just be careful, right? If you're planning on buying artwork from, um, you know, these Instagram artists and stuff, just be careful. Um, because it gets me every time I'm like you know what if they are a real artist like what if they're just trying to start out like I want to help right um, and they take advantage of that um, so you know it is what it is but you know, um, every time I've worked with a, like an artist that's doing commissions, um, you know, that's not like a scam, like they're very, uh, you know, they're good. Like they check in with me, they let me see the design process along the way. And if something goes wrong, um, you know, they try to fix it or they let you know what their limitations are. Scammers will just ghost you if you don't like what they send you. Or they'll be actually very rude. Which was the case, what happened to me. Um, yeah, very defensive, very rude. You know, they resort to like name calling and things like that. It's just very unprofessional. And I don't want anyone in our community to have to deal with that. If, if 
Pass. This is gonna be such a great day. these flowers so much. Thank you for the hug, Stephanie. farm and I thought okay like does his mouth open up do we go inside of him uh, but it doesn't look like there's a way to get inside right huh? I mean it's got to be here for a reason right it really doesn't look like something that would just be like decorative and I saw some people uh, saying something about like his back. So I wonder if there's something like that we have to do with these stitches.
wanted you to come this way. I need it. Oh, you're gonna get it soon. Yep, Rockbert plush. Cute. Is there anything else up here? So wait, is that what people were talking about then? Or is there something I have to do with these stitches? Oh. That, that was a fun little detour, though. I knew it was there because I saw it on Jupy's stream. But, um, Jupy had already done the thing, so I didn't know what to expect. And I was, like, pleasantly surprised. What a cute little plushie. I did not expect Frogbert to be that big, though, either. Gigantic. Pokeballs. If not, I can show you real quick. In the 
panels. Oh, hold on. It... Okay. So in the panel section underneath the stream, there should be like this Pokemon um, like widget thing. Um, so you go to your inventory, I believe, which is this backpack, I think. Um, or wait. Yeah, so go to the backpack, hit inventory, and you can go to shop here. And then you're able to like buy Pokeballs. Um, and you can, you know, enter however many you want to get. I hope that helps. I'm not sure how to get the money. I assume you just get it by playing the game. It builds up over time, but I hope that helps. I just learned it today from Sky, so. Oh my goodness, that didn't go well. Okay, so I have two of the pink flowers. Ooh, what's this one? That looks pretty. <gasps> Ooh, tulips? My sister would love that. Roses, okay. Oh my goodness. I need to keep catching all the bugs because I want... I want all the flowers. I'm gonna plant them everywhere. We'll have to do like a paleo decorating stream soon. We got both balls good, I'm glad. I'll still get the flowers, but I'm curious about that. Also more plushies apparently, but I have no idea how to get them. I wonder if they're just sort of like hiding around or something, like hidden in little nooks and crannies somewhere. No idea. I really was not expecting frog bird be that big. This is insane. Super cute. Oh, blueberries. Okay. Random. Silk too, don't they? The princess, like, 
Why can't I catch him? I'm so bad at this today. Oh, well, you know what? I'm not going to say that. It's been a very long time since I played, and I'm still getting used to the new computer, so I'm just going to give myself some more time. Wait, I'm gonna make a lavender farm uh, or lavender field. It's gonna be so cute. I think Cernux now have a chance to drop Cernux plush. What? What? We're about to find him. Guess what we're doing now. After we go home and empty our pockets. Let's hunt. Let's go hunting. other arrow was that standard arrow. I love these bushes so much. You're updating Paleo? Are you home? Ray, are you home? Ah, I'm so glad. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have to go say hello to my husband, y'all. I'll be back in a second.
Okay, we are back. Am I muted? Or can you hear me? Hold on here. All right, you're good. I, <laughs> I'm not muted. All right, back to some paleo. Oh, these are so cute. Oh my goodness, this was the best thing to just add. Flowers and bushes. This is amazing. There's a regular Cernok and an elder Cernok. Yeah. probably hunt both. I don't know which one the plushie will come out of. If it does. Like, I'm so excited though. That's gonna be so cute. Paleo knows what we want. They know we want plushies. And plants. So two new plushies. Oh, so there's a regular Cernuck plushie and an elder Cernuck plushie. That's what you meant, you think? Oh, that's exciting. Okay, where do I wanna plant these? I'm gonna plant these and then I might, hold on, what are these? Are these gardenias again? These roses, oh my goodness. Oh, sorry, I hit the wrong button there. Where do I want to put? trying to decide if I want this other gardenia here. I'm just gonna put it by my house for now. I'll put away my pumpkins, finally. I haven't decorated in so long, so I might actually spend quite a bit of time on my plot um, soon here so that I can maybe make like a like an English garden or something with all these new flower items I love them so much so focused when decorating. I, um, yeah, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Hopefully, maybe we'll do some, like, decorate with me videos so we can just decorate together. Um, because, yeah. It is one of my favorite things to do.
help it here. It's hard to water these sometimes. There we go. Water here. Um, I can't quite figure out how to water some. Okay, I might have to move it maybe. So those worked. Oh my. So it must be just a little bit off maybe. Oh, there we go. Oh, I have to water in the bricks. Gotcha. Or in the stone. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. That makes sense. Okay, as long as they grow, I'm not gonna keep it. I can't quite figure out. What am I doing wrong? Uh, are. Oh no. I might have to move those. We'll see what happens though. <laughs> Gotta make sure you're looking at what you're watering. Try to make sure the aimer is on it. Yeah. I I mean, it's just here with the flowers. I'm gonna have to play around with it. It doesn't seem to work like, like watering the other the crops and stuff. Unless I'm missing something. in a weird spot. I'll figure it out later. almost watering the roots of it like next to it like this is the spot where it started watering so I don't know maybe it's just there's something weird with where I placed the other one you know what would be really pretty if I put like bushes and flowers around this fountain too oh my gosh I'm so excited oh, I'm so excited okay so Right, I was thinking about going and either catching more bugs to get more flowers or hunting um, to see if I could get the plushie if it exists. Um, do you want to do either or with me? 
Or are you doing your own thing? <laughs> a limit on what? Oh my God, why is the limit number for the flowers? What limit number, what? I don't like that. I want all the flowers. I get it though. Hunting Cernox would be fine. Okay, cool, cool. Oh. then we can save some Cernuck meat for Tao. know when you're ready and we can meet somewhere. <laughs> you come to see me? Sounds good. Come back real soon. Ah, uh, do you want to go get your frogbert plush, or did you already do it? I love that. So cute. What a good outfit. Do you want to hunt here or in Bahari? Okay. You'll do it another time, gotcha. Um, do you want to hunt here in Bahari? Should we just go try to find some Cernuts? Either works, okay. Let's just, uh, let's just walk towards Bahari. Again, there's usually quite a few there. Um, and then we can sort of like, we'll just stop uh, when we see a group of them. I wonder if there's a Chapa plush that'll come. Probably not. Because we got them from the... From the Magi Market. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna head kind of over here and see if there's like a group of Cernak. And um, if you want to go a different way, just um, I'll follow you. But there's usually some Cernak over here. This is so pretty. Look at these flowers. Oh my goodness. I love them. These are 
are so pretty. Oh, here's one. Oh, you're going the other way. You got one too. Ready? Can't tell. Oh, wait. We might have to go to Bahari, unless you already got that one too. Yeah, I think the arrows and stuff that I have are probably too strong for these turn up. Unless we use um, the ones that I just made, but I'm not sure if they still kill in one hit. Did you get that one? Hold on, let me change my arrows. I'm gonna use either these or the standard arrow. Maybe I'll use, or maybe I'll use these. Let's see if that helps. Oh no. Did you get it too? Oh, you missed? Okay. That's okay. We can do more. Bahari has the Elder Cernox. Yeah. Okay. Let's move this. or at least I did.
right, how is everyone doing on your drops? Let me know if they're working for you or if you need some help. If you've been here since the beginning of stream or close to the beginning, you should have all three of your drops already. So let me know. Let me know if you need any help. Yeah, check your drops. Um, and it's just a reminder if anyone needs to know how to do that, press uh, M, take you to your map, uh, go up here to news. And they'll be here. Um, they will be here for you to paint. I finished the site. Chris is napping, but I'm so glad I'm done with that site. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. Good job. Good work. All right, right. Let me see here. Do you have, um, let me, oops, all right, let me check this real quick. Okay. So if you, um, did you go to Twitch yet? I, I forgot there's a step here. Um, have to go to your Twitch channel or like your Twitch account. And um, there should be like a Twitch notification. It might pop up or um, like there's a drops inventory. Um, if you click the link in the uh, in the stream, so the one uh, where it says claim your drops here, um, it's the first link in the command here. Um, click on that and see if they're there um, on your Twitch and it should say like claim. Okay. So try that and then go in to your like news thing in your game and see if it sends it to you. works or not. There's there are a few steps, so let me know. Actually, just a really pretty, like, scene. Oh.
I'm really bad at hunting. Oh my. I need to practice. It's been a long time. And I wasn't that great at it in the beginning. Uh, but I'm definitely better now than I was when I first started playing. I'm all connected now and claimed, so just waiting for them to show in news. Thank you for your help. Good, I'm so glad. Yeah, they should show up in the news pretty quickly. So happy for you. The Sandy Pale Cat plushie is so cute. If Animal Crossing had hunting, I would be awful at it. <laughs> oh my goodness. I can't even imagine because I struggle sometimes just catching the bugs and like cherry blossom leaves and um, you know cherry blossom petals more likely and um, the maple leaves and stuff I struggle with that so I can only imagine hunting would be it'd be cruel to have hunting in that game though because a lot of the villagers are huntable like you know Yeah, no, I just, I didn't get lost. I got distracted. I'm really sorry. <laughs> we got him. Like we might have another person to hunt with, maybe. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. How did I get that one? I, I don't think I got it. We're all out here trying to get the Cernuck plushes. There's one behind you. Ray, should we get this one? I think it's an elder. I cannot see your way. Ah! Okay. That was funny. I'm standing right behind you and. <laughs> Wait, is that a flow tree? Ooh, it is. It's a flow tree. like Animal Crossing where you invite people to your land. Sort of, yeah, but without an island, um, we have like a house plot that you can like decorate and like build a, a whole bunch of buildings on and stuff. Um, and people can come visit that. Um, but uh, the world is uh, kind of shared and you don't really decorate outside your home plot. I hope that makes sense. Oh, what a good, uh, what a good starter Pokemon, Stephanie. Super cute. Welcome to the Pokemon community game. Uh, 
Um, Stephanie, just so you know, if I, if you didn't already know, uh, Palea is free. Um, like you can totally just download this and play it. Um, you can either play it on your computer or on Steam has it now too. Um, it's on Switch. Am I, why am I not seeing? I don't see it here. Am I, am I blind? Oh, there it is. I am shooting flare arrows at it. Can we just pretend that didn't happen? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh no. I need to I need to put a server note there so that people don't like come and try to <laughs> Oh my goodness, y'all. Okay, hold on a minute. <laughs> I just don't like being overwhelmed by all the games I'm playing. Fair, fair. This one does take a quite a bit of time. I may try it. I like playing only a few games at a time, and I have Animal Crossing, the new Peach game, and Mario Wonder. But I should be done with Mario and Peach soon. You know what? The good thing about Palea, I mean, there are like some like timed events in Palea, um, but they're very good with like, you just get to do everything at your own pace, and they're very good at letting people know like when certain things are gonna be like coming around in a cycle again. Um, but it's, it's definitely not like Dreamlight Valley or anything like that, where you have to like really keep up on it. Um, it it's not gonna be like that big of a deal if you like start late or um, miss certain things really. At least that's been my experience so far. I don't wanna speak for everybody, cause obviously huh? there's no way for me to know. I just used three smoke bombs on a stink bug. <laughs> uh, hold on a second. Did the paleo just disappear? Or am I in the wrong spot? What just happened? Oh, that's a bummer. I... Um...
Timber. You wanna say hi? Come here. No, you cannot have my fruit. Come on, good girl. Wanna say hi to the stream? Come on. Good girl. I don't know if they can see you there, sweets. You're gonna have to come this way. Cute. Who's my good girl? I love you. Oh, she just wants some pets. All right. Let's go find Ray now so I can continue trying to find the Cerna plushie. Oh, Bridget! Anybody want to come get this Mujin? I don't know. Oh, I think we missed him. I'm so bad at that. Oh my goodness. Yeah, they went in that tree. Climbed up for a few. Okay, I can't tell if you went like up or I went the wrong way. You went this way. Oh for the Cernok that I assume I missed then. Yeah, I'm assuming it's dead. I'm, I'm assuming, I think she just killed it and then ran up that wall. Um, and I'm assuming I didn't um, hit it at all because I didn't get a loot bag. It's okay. We tried. And she got it. And I think she was the one that um, was chasing it originally, so I'm glad that she actually did get it.
late are you streaming? Just curious. Hey, um, I mean, whenever, until, until we want to do our double date. So whenever you guys are ready, um, you know, Ray and I can hop off and come over. Um, if anybody needs more time for your Twitch drops, don't worry. I'm going to straight over to another, uh, Kayla streamer who's got drops on. So, you know, he'll be okay. We're ready when you're ready. Okay, Ray, do you want to maybe get off at like maybe 6.15? Maybe 10 minutes? How does that sound to you? We can play more Pelia tonight too when we get home. If you want to um, find the plushie. Oh, it looks like you got it. No? Sounds good to you? Okay, good. Yeah. So let's... um. We're gonna uh, we're gonna stream for about ten more minutes, and then uh, I'm gonna do a raid over to another Paleo streamer, so everybody who still needs drops um, can get them. And you know we can support some other awesome Paleans, meet some new friends, hopefully. <gasps> Look, another blue one. Ray, are you over here? You're 80, uh, here it's coming, it's coming. I heard it. Unless it's not. Oh my goodness, I'm so bad at finding these. That's fine. Why do I have my fishing pole out? What am I doing? You guys, I'm I'm a bad video game player. I'm a bad streamer. <laughs> Practice makes progress. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, another one. Hold on. Is this 
this one? Oh, hold on. Okay. I thought it might have glitched for a second. Okay, he's down here. Now he's over here. We got him. minutes. I think we can probably get a few more. <laughs> I totally didn't see you just shoot the ground. <laughs> yeah, that happened. And it will not be the last time, I'm sure. It's definitely not the first time. Good thing I like forging and crafting. I can just make more arrows. Is that a Cernuck? No, it's a... Um, I can't remember what they're called. Mugens? I just call them puppies. <laughs>
pretty this time. They look more blue now. I love these flowers. So pretty. This is why I never get anything done in Paleo. <laughs> oh, I'm just like, oh my goodness, look how pretty everything is. And honestly, on the computer, it's so much better on this computer than it was when I was playing on my laptop. Oh no, I'm not gonna get that. Sorry, Ray. There are a whole bunch of Sternock over here, though. We do have to log off soon, though. Let's see if I can find someone to stream. Or to raid. Should we go back and check that Pallium to see if someone got it yet? is still standing there. I wonder if things just disappear now, like after a certain time frame. <laughs> yeah, I might. Sorry, yeah, we lost it. I'm gonna have to, we're gonna have to start waiting for people next time. Make sure um, we all get to loot it before or it's gone. Um, but I think what I'm gonna do is wrap up stream here. Um, but I do appreciate you guys being here so, so, so much. I had so much fun with you today. And I'm really excited for our next stream. I had a lot of fun playing Kalia. Let's find another streamer that has their drops on. I'll be back on Sunday. We're either going to be playing Animal Crossing or more Palea. It just depends on how we feel that day. Maybe both. Maybe a little bit of Dreamlight Valley. Um, you know, I know that it's it's probably not the best idea to have um, like three games that I'm choosing from that day. Um, but I just, I'm loving all three of them at the moment. So I, I don't know what I'm going to feel like playing. Um, so... Let's get ready for this raid, and then I'm really hoping to see you guys on Sunday, if you can make it. And then Monday, I'm going to be joining uh, Little Mix Honey um, at uh, noon, and we'll be doing some like mood boards or vision boards, um, 
talking about the eclipse. Um, so that would be, let me just double check and make sure. Yeah, so I'm gonna be going on at noon, Eastern Standard Time. Um, but the stream actually starts at like 10 a.m. Central Time. So we'll be, you know, we'll be on stream for like an hour or so before I jump on. Um, but if you're available on Monday, um, please stop by and hang out with um, with Honey and me and the whole gang of ghoulies. Um, I'm really looking forward to that day. It's going to be so much fun. Um, so I will see you then. Thank you so, so much for being here. And I'm going to be prepping this raid and we'll wrap up stream. <laughs>